Hi, my name is Dr. Yagish Lankadeva, and I'm a National Heart Foundation Future Leader Research Fellow working at the Florey Institute on Neuroscience and Mental Health. I'm asking for your support to help me save the lives of intensive care patients. The major focus of my research is to understand what drives acute kidney injury in patients that acquire severe infections, or in other words, sepsis, and also patients undergoing open heart surgery that also end up in intensive care units. Acute kidney injury happens in 50% of patients with sepsis and also in 30% of patients undergoing open heart surgery. Not only does this kill up to one third of the patients affected in the short term, those who survive are at a long term risk of developing chronic kidney disease, heart failure and stroke. This has remained a major unresolved clinical problem for two main reasons. The current diagnosis of acute kidney injury relies on markers of kidney damage that has already happened when it's usually too late to intervene. Second, the exact mechanisms driving acute kidney injury remains unclear. I strongly believe that my research is leading to solutions to both these problems. I have discovered that there is a reduction in blood supply, particularly to the inner region of the kidney, that deprives this area of oxygen, which can cause the cells to malfunction and our kidneys to fail. But how do we detect this in patients? Because our kidneys produce urine, which then gets passed down to our bladder, I have discovered that bladder urinary oxygen levels very closely reflect the oxygen levels within our kidneys. The placement of a catheter in the bladder is routine practice in patients treated for sepsis in intensive care units. It's also routine practice in patients undergoing open heart surgery in operating theatres. Therefore, in collaboration with our industry partners, we have developed an oxygen sensing probe that can be advanced to the tip of a standard bladder catheter, which allows us to monitor kidney health in real time and predict kidney failure up to 24 hours before current clinical diagnostic tests. This technology is now in clinical studies at Austin Health, Monash Health and Royal Melbourne Hospital. Using these mechanistic insights, I'm now developing a novel therapeutic strategy to prevent or reverse acute kidney injury arising from infections and open heart surgery. But I need your support by voting for my application in the 2018 Centenary Institute Medical Innovation Awards. Thank you.